Hello everyone, I hope that you are doing well. In this video, I'm going to show that how you can uh, configure and run MPTCP or Multipass TCP only with a click in a couple of seconds. Normally, uh, for running and configuring and running MPTCP, you should do some uh, steps. You should install the MPTCP, uh, which you should uh, follow the instruction. You should do the configuration for the uh, routing. You should uh, make some changes to the group and some other changes that you need to do before having MPTCP on your PC, uh, which is uh, uh, cumbersome and sometimes it is uh, hard to do. But if you want to install, run, configure MPTCP uh, with only one click, uh, you should, you can download the script file that I have written from my GitHub, which the link is in the description, and you can uh, copy that to your Linux, and then you only need to run it. So after that, uh, I'll move it to the folder that you want uh, to have the files that are going to be downloaded over there. Then open your terminal, and the only thing is to run that script. So point the slash. Then the only thing you need to do is to wait, sit and wait for the MPTCP to be configured. Okay, the wrong password. Okay, now everything is now everything is done, and the only thing you need to do is to reboot uh, is to reboot your system. And when the system is going to be run again, you will see that some options, uh, some menus are going to be appeared in the beginning. So over there you can choose the MPTCP, uh, the kernel with the MPTCP capability. Now you can see uh, there are some options. You should uh, choose advanced options for Ubuntu. Then you can choose the kernel with MPTCP. Now this kernel is MPTCP capable and uh, you can use the benefits of it to have more bandwidth, more download uh, speed, uh, less page load time uh, and other uh, advantages that it can bring. And finally, if you want to see that uh, MPTCP is uh, running on your uh, system, you can check it that it is enabled or not. For this we have a command and uh, you can use it to check it. So you write sys ctl net mptcp enabled and you can see that it is enabled and you can use the mptcp on your system. In the uh, next videos we will have a look on how to use MPTCP and what are the advantages of using multipass TCP.